I don't think any driver gets into the category knowing where or how long your uh, future and career will be. But uh, for me now to stand here after two decades and uh, talk about the 600 Club is, is quite amazing. I think that there's no doubt there's a lot of drivers in that 500 bracket. Um, I don't think I'll be the, the last to be in the 600, but uh, you know, very thankful to be the first. At the moment, we're contracted to the end of this year and next year. So really for us, it's a matter of uh, you know, trying to keep that uh, you know, performance up. Uh, you know, I'd like to think that we can go on beyond the end of 17 with Roland and the team. And, uh, but you know, again, we've just got to make sure that we put our best foot forward, we keep performing. Um, if we do that, well then we're obviously uh, you know, in a much better, a stronger position to put pen to paper. So uh, I'll be uh, somewhere through next year, be asking Roland what he wants to do, because I'd love to continue. Over the decades, the, the, the category has changed quite a lot. Now we've got, you know, we classify each day as a race start. Uh, you know, back when I first started, I think we had about eight rounds of the of the year. Now we've, uh, you know, we've got 15 rounds and a bit over 30 races. So uh, the potential of other drivers getting into that 600 club is more easier than what it was. But knowing, you know, as I said, I won't be the last, but I'm, I'm very thankful to be the first. So it's come Sunday, it'll be a bit of motion. I think it'll be nice to, uh, to, to get out on the grid. Hopefully we can back it up with a great result. Like I've always seen in a lot of teams that I've been with, once they get their first taste of their first victory, they want more. And uh, of course, we're striving like everyone else to try and make that possible. Keep that momentum going now from QR and uh, you know, hopefully this weekend we can.